Assalamu alaikum students, I am Usman from Conceptual Chemistry Zone and today we will start the chapter number 4 from the second year book. And in this video we will try to understand the basic properties and the introduction of group 5A elements. But before starting the topic, if you are new on my channel, I will request you to please subscribe my channel so you can get more informative videos like this. Thank you so much. Now let's move on to the topic. The elements of group 5A are nitrogen, phosphorus, arsenic, antimony, and bismuth. They have 5 electrons in the outermost orbital, 2 are in p orbital, and 3 in 2 are in s orbital and 3 in p orbital. The ele electrons in p orbital are usually unpaired. When they unpair their electrons of s orbital, they can show the oxidation state of 5 instead of 3. But the nitrogen cannot do so. Anyhow, antimony and bismuth shows the oxidation state of 5 due to their inert pair effect. Now let's talk about the general characteristics of group 5A elements. Except nitrogen, all elements of group 5A occurs in the combined state and the nitrogen contributes approximately 80% of the earth crust as the earth's atmosphere. All the elements of group 5A shows allotropy except bismuth. Nitrogen is usually present in the form of gas while all the other group 5A elements are solids. And when we move from top to bottom in group 5A, the melting and boiling point usually increases, but the trend of bismuth is usually abnormal. The melting point of arsenic is 816 degrees centigrade at 39 atmosphere while it sublimates at 615 degrees centigrade. The ionization energies, electron affinities and electronegativities decreases down the group in the group 5A. Nitrogen and phosphorus are non-metallic in nature. Arsenic and antimony are metalloid in nature while bismuth is a metal. The elements of group 5A gives the oxides of type M2O3, M2O4 and M2O5. Anyhow, the nitrogen also gives N2O and NO. The N2O is also called the laughing gas, which is very important from exam point of view. They ask you that what is the formula of laughing gas, you have to memorize the formula, which is N2O. The elements of group 5A gives the hydrides of general formula MH3 and also gives trihalides and pentahalides of general formula MX3 and MX5. Anyhow, nitrogen cannot give MX3. If we talk about the peculiar behavior of nitrogen, we will come to know that nitrogen differ from the family members in many aspects. In diatomic form, the nitrogen exists in free state. Moreover, it is chemically inert as compared to others. Nitrogen also exists in the combined state in living matter, in plants and animals. It also exists in the form of proteins, urea, and amino acids. This is all about the general introduction of group 5A elements. If you really like these kind of videos, then don't forget to subscribe my channel. Thank you so much for watching. And inshallah, we will cover your syllabus in this month. And then we will also start a test series in our channel. So don't forget to subscribe it.